These are simply my opinions on gaming, pop culture, and why I do what I do. I do my research before I rant about anything. I may say things that you may agree or disagree with, but still, take it with a grain of salt. I'm not 100% correct on everything I say, and if you find any of it to be completely false, then feel free to correct me on said subject with proof. Also, be free to make your own beliefs. Don't just bag against someone else's. What up guys, Alchemist Hunter here, another rant video here, I have so much in my fucking mind. Things I gotta talk about. Um, like I said, I'm gonna start doing this a lot more. I like this, like I said, if you if you don't like it, just don't watch it, I'm sorry, I don't know what to tell you. This one's towards Marcus Baker, and he's gonna fucking hate me for this one. Fuck Soul Calibur, I, I just had to say it, I, I just had to say it, Marcus, I'm sorry bro, fuck Soul Calibur. I saw the other day, Marcus kept bringing it up, he's like, bro, you gotta play Soul Calibur, bro, you gotta play Soul Calibur. I'm like, I'm not playing this shit, bro, I don't fucking play fighting games. I know he's joking around, but he keeps bringing it back up. I'm like, motherfucker, fuck that, I'm not doing that shit. Fuck Soul Calibur, fuck Tekken, fuck all that. And the funny thing is, one of my a new, one of my newest YouTubers that I subscribe to, um, Avoiding the Puddle, that's all he plays is Tekken 7 now. And I'm like, Ugh. still won't play it, because I just can't fucking play it, I just... This is my thing of fighting games, too. I've been playing fighting games for a long time. I've been playing fighting games since PlayStation 1, right? But not hardcore, by any means. Not even casually, like below casually, because I didn't block for a long time. As a kid, you don't block. No, unless somebody's teaching you how to play fighting games, you don't block. It's something you learn over time, and you put the time into, and you finally get better and 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 better. But you honestly don't block as a kid. Don't don't fucking lie to me. Say, oh, yeah, I was the best fighting champion out there. I was fucking, come on, Mali, all these motherfuckers, dog. Yeah, 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 yeah. You wasn't. Stop lying to yourself. You are fucking fucked up, and you, even whether if you're sh your bigger brother or your whatever was showing you how to show the ropes, or you was the bigger brother and you was beating your little brother's ass, or your little sister's ass, whatever the fuck, you were always not blocking. You was just like, hey, I know how to avoid you doing the same shit to me. I'm just gonna hit you first, and never let you get up. That's just how it was. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me, motherfuckers. Right? Not many people as kids were like learning how to play fighting games. It just wasn't that. It's just, it's just a really weird concept of just blocking. Even now, me blocking, I do it just because I know how to do it. I don't do it when it's the timing is right. I don't counter, all right? I don't do any of that. I know certain buttons. I get certain combinations and shit like that. But if you told me PK forward three, you're like, I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't get that. It doesn't make fucking sense. It just doesn't fucking work, all right? It just don't work. Don't work with me. Another reason I don't like fighting games, bros, you know why? Online. Online is horrendous. Got these players who've been playing fucking Tekken since the, their fucking birth date. And these are the motherfuckers who are hardcore. Or the people who really pick up quick on fighting games. It's just a genre that some people can pick up on. Just the same way me and you, Marcus, can pick up on a wrestling game. No matter what it is, it can be the shittiest wrestling game in the world or the best wrestling game in the world. We just pick up on it quickly because that's just what we know. We know our shit. Right? Same with uh, Joey with his Dragon Ball Z games. He may he may not understand the shit at all, but he just knows because he knows all the people in it. He just hey, yeah, 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 that guy does that. That guy does that. And I'm like, how do you know that? Like, how do you know he's gonna set it up? He's like, I just fucking know. It's just one of those things where you just know. And fighting games is something I cannot step into. It's one of those things where I have to simply take myself away from everything else that I do in the gaming in my gaming life and put it all towards that. I do not have the time, I do not have the energy to learn a new game like that. That's like me going and play NBA 2K. Oh yeah, you just shoot the ball in the hoop. I'm seeing motherfuckers over here doing advanced plays and shit, doing timeouts and at the right time, they substituting motherfuckers and I'm like, bro, can I just shoot the ball in the hoop? I never substituted back in the day. I never had to substitute shit. Now it's too realistic. Oh, fuck that. Fighting games can be rough as hell. It comes down to ha fuck it. It can come down to just a certain move just being countered at the right moment and just picking them up off the ground and throwing them around, dude. It comes down to right the right person you pick. Sometimes it comes down to just who you go against. Sometimes you just have this person who just knows how to counter your shit better than the next guy. It's just how it be. I. It doesn't matter. Then uh, fucking you know, Marcus sent me a bro. You gotta play Soul Calibur. It's an easy game to pick up. Nah, dude, it's a fighting game. I can't fucks with it, dude. I can't fucks with it. I can't. I just can't fucks with it. It doesn't matter if it's, it's a fighting game, it just ain't for me. I've played many fighting games before. I've said this before. I played with Tekken, I think it was Tekken 3 that was on PS1. And uh it was like it was it was always it was just always a shit show. My my friend uh used to have a bunch of fighting games. And I was like, this is cool. Like the games look amazing though. You know, the graphics of the time were just cool as fuck looking. You know, games like Bloody Roar and things like that. I was like, oh, oh yeah, cool, 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 cool. Fucking hated it. 
games like Melee that were never supposed to be a fighting game turn into a fighting game, and now I hate it because they treat it like it's a fighting game. It's this competitive, you know, competitive smash. I suck a dick, son. It wasn't supposed to be competitive by any means. It was just a goofy ass game where they had stuff, and people have turned it into that. And now the newer games turn into that. It turns into this competitive mode where it's just garbage to play. You can't, you want to play it casually, and even the AI fight in this different manner where it's more of a competitive thing now. Instead of it being fun and trying out new stuff, I remember me and my friend used to end every day by at the end of the day of school is to head his way, right? His mother used to have a day here. And we used to just say, hey, the kid's cool. We're, we're the older kids. We said, hey, we're going to go play some fucking Smash Brothers Melee. We played Melee for an hour until my bus came and picked me up. Every day. Every fucking day. We used to play that shit. Fun as hell. Fun as fuck. Fun as fuck. I used to play sh I was like, yeah. We used, to we used to do shit. We used to play wrestling with them. We used to have Donkey Kong against fucking, um... It was Donkey Kong versus like Bowser because they had the grab moves and you could like throw people around. It was Kirby and we used to be playing on, uh, I forgot what it was, uh, Green Greens with the fucking, uh, what was it? The, the trees to blow and push you, everyone, at one angle. It pushed all the items and all that shit. So we used to break open the shit and because he knew I liked wrestling, we turned it into something. So what we would do is we'd take like a guy like Kirby, break all the, break the whole floor apart and just have him just take a guy, grab him, and suplex him right through the fucking ground and kill everyone. It was so cool. It was moments like that. But then, after, uh, was it, Brawl came out, people was like, Yo, this, this game needs some work, bro. This game sucks, bro. Melee was a shit. And I'm like, Brawl is kind of trash, but, you know, Melee is better and shit too. I get it, but... You know, it's alright, you know, you know, next game's gonna come out, it's gonna kick ass, and it did. It ended up coming out and it kicked ass. It was cool, it added all these new people and shit. Where, you know, Brawl didn't. Brawl just didn't do it. And Brawl was, I think Brawl was be becoming a fighting game as well at that point. Because I think they started to realize that Melee players were starting to really turn this into something. And that's when I truly got kicked off from that game, because then I was like, you guys are treating this casual game like a fighting game, like it's gonna be a competitive thing, like, now it's becoming competitive as fuck. And you're like, what the fuck are you guys doing? It's this basic ass game, but they turn it into this fucking thing that you just couldn't fathom at the moment. And now it's fucking crazy. And I don't want to play it. It's not the competitive nature or anything that made me not like fighting games. It's just, I know. I go online, I'm gonna go against these people who's like, oh yeah, that's my third account, I'm gonna go against these noobs and start smashing faces because they can't win against the other guys, so they're gonna make a new account. You know how easy, if you have, did you know guys, did, you, did anyone know that if you have a PlayStation Plus account, you can make as many accounts as you want on that the, on that um, console? And not only that, they all have PlayStation Plus included with them because PlayStation Plus is, is activated on the system. Did you know that? So the, any idiot can come and say, yeah, I'm the dumb fucking, yeah, I'm a noob. All of a sudden, he's doing fucking false combos to you, and you're getting your ass beat. Yes, I said false combos, because they're making fucking sense, but that's just something that they'd fucking make up. Oh, it's a false combo. It's a false what? Yeah, you're dead. But how's it, then how's it false? It's false because you didn't see it coming, bitch, but a combo came your way. Like, you just don't know. They just make up shit all the fucking time. You know what I mean? I, I've looked at Tekken, and I see the way it plays, and like, honestly, dude, I just can't get into it. It's such a good game, and it's not, they, it's not like these games are bad, it's just, I can't get into it. It doesn't matter if it's Injust Ass, or, sorry, Injustice, or Injust Ass, as uh, Aris likes to call it from there. Well, it doesn't matter if it's fucking Soul Calibur, Smash Bros, whatever other fighting game you can think of. If I look at my whole list of games right now, and I said this in the last rant, I didn't say it in the last rant, but I was marking, throwing off games that I have. I don't have any fighting games besides uh, One Piece Running Blood, and even that game online is fucked up. The counter systems really can get real deep. It's such a simple and basic game with the controllers, but then the controls really start getting in when people start figuring out ways to counter shit out and be an asshole. That's another reason I don't like fucking fighting games. It's just assholes. You got these guys who are not human anymore. These are guys like subhuman, metahumans and shit. Goddamn 
Star Wars characters in this shit. Goddamn X Men united in fuck. These guys are not human beings. These guys are fucking play this shit day in and day out. Know every fucking counter. Don't may not may or may not know how to use every character, but know how to use one character well better than any other person. And they fucking kill it. And they bring that they bring that same shit to a tournament. And those game guys may go past that tournament and make themselves stronger and better and say, hey, that experience almost fucked my day up. I got past it. And then they go on to Evo and they're like, oh yeah, I'm getting money, bitch, top of the fucking food chain. And only one can make it at the end of the day. I hate to be that guy that's in, in any part of that. You know what I'm trying to say? I just don't want to be in any part of the fucking the reason why this guy made it to the top because he's going against a fucking noob ass like myself or a guy like myself that hey I got past all the noobs and I got to your level somehow some way and I guess get smashed and he's like oh you're out of the tournament bitch couldn't do it just couldn't do it anyways guys I'm Alchemist 100, Alchemist 100 here and I, what the fuck am I talking about <laughs> what up uh, did, you need to I, I need to stop <laughs> I'm Alchemist 100 uh, I think I'm gonna see you guys later so until then, peace out and good shit, huh? Yeah. Peace.